many actors outside this process are ready to support our efforts. I have seen, for example, that women are actively seeking solutions and exercising leadership in their communities. Let us help empower them and boost their contributions. It is for this reason that I held and participated in a number of formal and informal consultations in our preparations for this conference. One of such informal consultations was the Continental Consultative Dialogue on the impact, impact of climate change on women that we recognized, we, that we organized last week in Pretoria, whose outcomes will be made available to delegates. I am singling out this consultation, and not that the others were not important, but because we now have women leaders at the helm of the SCOB and its CMP. The outgoing president, a woman and a very capable woman, the executive secretary, a woman and a capable woman, and the incoming president. It's a very nice coincidence. So we will not miss this opportunity to make good use of it. The concern with climate